What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, Long Live Char, aka Greatness, aka the Red Comet. Guys, as you can see, your boy has the PS5. As you guys can see, 2K21. To really show that I'm on the PS5, look, you can't do this on the PS4. You can't do this on the PS4. Man, guys, the PS5 has just been, this shit is so smooth. It's just completely smooth, guys. For those who didn't have, for those who don't have the PS5 yet, don't worry. You're going to get it. It takes about patience. But this shit here is smooth as hell. And I do recommend if you didn't want it, if you think about getting it next year, no, get that shit now. Because this, this is it. This is it. So, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to like this video. Even if you are subscribed, like this video. Subscribe to the channel. Comment. And hit that bell for notification when I do upload. You'll be the first one to look at this video. So, without further ado, guys. As you can see, we're going to find a good power forward build. So, the point in this video is I'm going to show you guys the most all-around power forward. I will find the all around powerful. It's dominant in the paint, get rebounds, shoot, slash, possibly dribble. I don't dribble, dribble so personally, I'm not gonna focus on that in this video. So it's gonna be mainly, you know, dunking, shooting, and get a rebounds. And I have been, since I got the PS5, this is like, this afternoon i just been constantly checking out stats after stats after stats and i think i figure out how to get it to that right point so without further ado let's get on with this video all right so as you can see seven foot no let's make them um, six eight six eight or six nine as you can see six nine 610 for 68. His shooting goes up. Mid range 3 to 85. Ball can handle. Everything just goes up tremendously. Like this. Like his offensive rebound dropped, but it's still a 90. Defensive rebound, a 95. Like, look at this. Speed, 79. 76. Acceleration. Strength is a 95. Like, this is a power four. Like, this is crazy. Now wait. Now if you make him 280, his static dunk is still at 87. Come on, man. Like, dog, like this shit here. Now wingspan. Let's see. Now his wingspan 72. Let's look at his shooting. Shooting. Oh shit, his shooting is still at 80. His mid range is at 86. His three point is at 81. Now, so when you do go against a center, 2K was smart about this. They, they're, they're not stupid anymore. They're not falling for the same shit. If you are a center, you're going to get out snagged by a fucking center. That's a pure rebounder. You, you, you just are. Because their wingspan goes up to a, what is that? A eight? Is that eight, 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 inch, eight, two, eight, one inches? Eight, yeah, like eight inches. So... Like, I'm just saying, guys, this is, like, the best possible powerful. Like, this is the best, like, position. Like, not, not position, but it's the best archetype you can use for this power, for this position. So, 7-6, that's the highest it's going to go. But I wonder if I make him 6-9. Is this wingspan? Yeah, this wingspan goes up. What about? Yeah. So, the higher... The height is the longer your wingspan, but 6'8 is cool. 6'8 wingspan is cool, right? You can go with everybody's shit. I'm going with solid. Continue. And for attributes. So, we're going to max out close shot. Always do that. Driving layup. Driving dunk. Post control. No, standing dunk. Cool. Mid range. Three point. Ball handle. Speed with ball. I'm going to pass accuracy along for a little bit. 
interior defense, max that out, perimeter defense, defensive rebounds, 95 up speed, acceleration, strength, vertical, stamina. All right, stamina's a 90. So pass accuracy is cool. But right here is the build. This is the stats I'm looking at. Like this is just this is this is the build. Cause your vertical is an 88, man. Like look at this. 76 speed, 74 acceleration. Like this, this is it. Everything on this build is just nice. This is this is the build, ladies and gentlemen. This is the build. Alright, continue. Alright, so as you can see, 2K has multiple primary takeovers. They have multiple takeovers, multiple ones. So think about it, you're a power forward. You can dribble, not dribble, but you can dunk, rebound, and shoot. If I do go against a center position, I wanna be able to get rebounds. You're, you're a power forward. Don't forget your main objective is to always get rebounds always so you want to look for how much you would rebound limitless range Whoa, look at this limitless range wow i mean look at all this look you get spot up like oh my extreme clamps drop stuff in. oh my god box out wall allows you to bl block out strength mm, look Tongue twister allows you to block out stronger players or swim around them to score, secure more rebounds. So I might get that one. Uh, see the future shows you what it means. Glass clearing dimes boost your teammates defensively. Not picks up, no. Box out. These are lockdown badges. I need rebound. So see the future. Shows you. So this is dimes for centers. Um, give an upper hand and chasing boards or allows you to block out stronger players or swim around them. Yeah, that would be it. Secondary. So we got box out. But so because the shooting's a little low, so you want to go with the shooting badges. So that makes sense. So don't forget, your primary goal is to rebound, but then the game can be all around too. So we got rebounds check. Shooting is the next priority. So Easy blow bys, drive by the fence, make it easy to get to the rim. That's nice. Limitless range, ability to shoot beyond the three. That's nice too. Spot out precision provides no. So we don't want that. Either one. Limitless range or easy blow bys. So limitless range is not part of the badge. You know what? If it is part of the badge, I'm not gonna get this. I'm gonna get easy blow bys because. They think I'm gonna shoot while I can also blow by and get to the um, to the rim. So at the same time, they gotta guard me from the three while at the same time I can take it in. So this will be yeah, easy blow bys. Yeah. A two way slashing shot creator. I like that. Dennis Rodman. Uh, <laughs> All right, guys. So we made a two way slashing shot creator. Let's build and let's figure out the badges. So finishing, that's easy because you're powerful. So let's put on back now. Finisher must Giant Slayer must posterizer must Hall of Fame Hall of Fame Hall of Fame. Then you have opportunity. Let's put this on silver. Slurry finisher, must, must, Where is it? Hall of Fame. And we get one more left, so that would probably, get at the Heat Seeker. And shooting, catch and shoot, put that gold. Hot zone hunter, put that goal. And 
Then again, because I'm not going to be shooting consistently, so you want to put... Yeah, take off Hot Zone Hunter, put Corner Specialist on Gold. And you put the last one on whatever, probably Hot Zone Hunter. So, Catch and Shoot, Gold, Corner Specialist, Gold, Hot Zone Hunter, Bronze. And we go to Playmaking. From here, you want Unpluckable, a must. Quick, first, might as well put Unpluckable Hall of Fame. Quick first step, matter of fact. Yeah, Quick First Step, Silver, Unpluckable Gold. Defensive badges should be pretty much easy, guys. You've been doing this forever. Box Out, Hall of Fame, Brick Wall, Hall of Fame. Um, Rebound Shape, Hall of Fame. And rest, once you get these main three, Hall of Fame, you're good, you're good. So you can just put Post, post Lockdown, on Hall of Fame, um, Worm is always a good one to have. Put that Hall of Fame. Reduces the chances of getting crossover. You're not going to be, you're not going to be guarding a point guard as much, so there's no point in putting that on. Pink Dodger is cool. Tireless Defender, Trapper, no. So for something like this, so. Pogo stick. It helps you. Pogo stick doesn't also. Yeah, improves the ability to recover and jump quicker at the landing. I was thinking because last mm, on PS4, it also doesn't. It helps you stick against defense. If someone was bigger than you, you can jump and it automatically contest them. But at the same time, people didn't know that Pogo stick also helps you get the rebound. It also helps you with that. So this is it pogo stick hall of fame worm hall of fame rebound chase hall of fame post lockdown hall of fame box hall of fame brick wall hall of fame this is it this is it ladies and gentlemen this is it this is how you should set up the build just like this but yeah guys tell me what you think in the comment section below i hope you guys did enjoy this video i will be bringing you more 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 um, content of great builds to make in 2K21 PS5, especially for power forwards. I'm gonna try to make it a thing. If not, if not, we'll see in the future. But yeah, guys, hope you did enjoy the video. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.